Hello my blissful bunch, I am Blissful Ignorance and we are back with Frambo. I am going to be putting a link down to the Team Trees donation page um, for Mr. Beast's t planting 20 million trees. If you haven't heard of it, go to his channel and check that video out because this is a huge deal for our environment and for moving forward in our future towards battling climate change. So make sure to go to that link and check out the donation page to check out the video to go and look at Mr. Beast's page and see what this is all about. Um, I hopefully will be starting to do something towards that as well soon, maybe not on camera but behind the scenes to donate towards this because one dollar equals one tree and this is hugely important guys for us, our future. I was looking at some of the stats towards how badly climate uh, the climate change has been getting over the years and honestly it just about made me cry this is really serious and although it's not the kind of change that will immediately make the difference but it, it's the kind of change that works towards making the difference we need and so this is really important so make sure you go check that out anyways back to the video i'm actually really sad because this hopefully not that i want it to be but hopefully will be the last episode we're going to get to the bottom of everything that's happening i don't know if everybody else is when they when they've gotten to this point or even if you're watching this for the first time um have figured it out by this point but i haven't i have no idea what's going on and i'm hoping it will all get cleared up in the end when i said i'd never played this game before i was 100 percent serious i've never played this before i've never even heard about it until not that long ago so I don't know anything about what's happening right now. But yeah, let's get into it. Um, continue. But I do know we need to go back. Because I had a look at some of... Uh, not ahead, but some of the clues as to what we needed to... Oh, that's freaky. Some of the clues as to what we need to do. So we need to go back in here. Oh, wait, wait, wait. wait. No, we don't. We need to go back. In here. Ah, oh, and I put it in the description of the last one, but I don't know about you guys, but does it feel like Fran's not evil, but doing whatever is necessary at this point to reach your goal, even at the expense of other people? Because realistically, that guy didn't, that skeleton didn't do anything to deserve having his teeth pulled out. And I think that was a part of the reason that made me feel so horrible, was because it wasn't even justifiable. And now look at him. I feel so bad. Get out. I don't want to speak with a tooth criminal. Skills and... It's just, it's sad. And I, I hope that she's not secretly the evil one in all this. That's definitely her eye too. That's weird. Oh. Is he gonna miss again? Uh, almost. <laughs> yes, I did it. Goodbye, Kamala. Wow, I don't feel the sadness anymore. Thank you. Oh, that's how we get the stick. I knew we had to do it to get the stick, not how we got it. Don't worry, I'm happy you feel better. I do feel better. Let me give you something in return. A piece of my flesh. A piece of me. There we go. You can plant it if, if you like. Hee hee. Thank you, sir. I have to go now. I must find my cat. I hope you find it. See you around. Nice to see you again. Did you find your cat already? Not yet, but I'm not giving up. See you. What a nice tree. But one good deed doesn't make up for what she did to that poor guy. Um. So we need to go back through here. Then we use the stick to get the glove. Or to get the key. Sorry, we've got a glove. Fantastic. Fantastic. Oh my god, now I can reach it. Cool, we have a key. Back again. This is a cool elevator though. Does the cat's eyes follow us? If we, like. No, I can't check. Ooh, it's all bloody. Oh, 
Uh, yum. Oh. That's fantastic. Um. Right, what else do we need? A working bulb and a black wire. Creature from above, get out from Mabuka's den. You are not welcome. Excuse me, but I'm looking for my cat and I need to wake up Mabuka. Just Mabuka? Mother of Mabuka for you, arrogant little infant. Ooh. And how did you plan to wake her up, eh? With the crazy ideas of Cogwind? Cogwind is a nice clockmaker. He's not crazy. Ah, you know him. I assume you have been to Isturistra. I still can't, I actually know how to, like, I know it now, but I still can't say it. Isturistra. Isturistra. Hard place, I must say. Too dazzling. I like it. Well, that's, well, that's exactly where I want to go after I find my kitty. Good for you. You fragile, your fragile little mind will be safe there with all those boring creatures. I'm going now, you wicked tree. My kitty is waiting for me. Huh. You know, scare me a bit. Good girl. Let's talk to the red-eyed demon deer. Hello, goat. You look a bit like Rima. Ew, hello, little boar. Oh, oh, hello, little boar. I was going to say, ooh, that's a bit rude. You're much prettier though. These look like human skulls. Wow, that's a big beautiful face. She's kind of pretty. Right, where do we get this wire and a working bulb from? Let's go back into our room. There was no bulb in here, was there? No, no black wire either. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Any black wire? No. They telephone. What do I do with the telephone? Inside the little house. Yeah, we got that. Would forgot his hat, or maybe the hat forgot his head. Ha ha. Oh, mysterious paintings in a mysterious but Okay, I want to go back up here. Did we get anything from in here? Oh, bulbs. Awesome. Now we just need one more thing. We need the black wire, but I don't... I didn't remember seeing any. Oh. So we got everything we need. I think I must wake up Mabuka. tree? You're big. What was this hatch for? What do we find in there? Hello, the back, of the, the back of the giant cat. This must be for something important. It's quite dark in there. Do you need... Oh, wait, hold on. I was about to say, do you need a bulb? Uh-huh! Uh. 
Oh, we needed this as well. There we go. Wow, that's a big cat. You look exactly like Mr. Midnight. I have to find him. Yeah, okay, let's just... The cat's eyes do follow us. Okay. Oh, okay. It's finished! Yay! Examine. Fantastic, I'll wake up Mabuka with this. Mother Mabuka. Sorry. Here we go. That's so rude. Ah, beware of Mabuka. The awakened darkness rises from the unknown. I'm sorry to wake you, Mother Mabuka, but I need a favor from you. Can somebody tell me who this creature is? Quite insolent for such a tiny body. It's not a very feminine voice. Sorry, guys. Excuse me, but I can answer that myself. I'm Fran Bo, human girl, 11 years old, and very brave. So you know. A human in Mabuka's den. That's amusing. Who brought you here? Who disconnected? We're good. That would be Remo. I think he is your son. Isn't he? Did my son manage to enter your head already? You mean, like, cutting my head open? I don't think so. Did you drink or eat some sort of reddish potion or beans? Oh. 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 Beans? My pills look like red beans, so yes. Oh, I took a whole bottle. Then I cannot use violence against you. The power has been unleashed. Well, that's good. I hope you find beneath the ground the truth that you seek. Thank you, but what power has been unleashed? Can you tell me? The power inside you, don't you know? This really isn't such a... I could have given her such a feminine voice. You were selected by the five realms of essential existence to be the keeper of the key. Five realms of existence of essential existence can were created parallel with time. What what are you talking about? The keeper of the key? Who told you this? The great Volokos from Priviv told us everything a long time ago. This is a voice is like really hard to do after a minute. It's like hurting my head. The keeper will be hunted by the dark son of darkness after feeding from the red seed. But you are too young, I must say. Too young indeed to be the keeper of the key. There's something about you. Did something obscure happen to you? I think Rima killed my parents, Mother Mabuka. Can you imagine how it feels? I am all of these feel of those feelings, Franbo. I am all the sinister, all the darkness you can imagine. What keeps bumping in the night and making the dudunk noise? <sighs> okay. I feed from the tears and sorrow, from deep desperation and fear. But then you don't care for him to kill my parents. I thought you were nice. I am curious about knowing the reason, if that makes you feel better. Now understand, it's the reason itself, the truth you're seeking. No, now I understand, it's the reason itself, the truth you are seeking. Go on, Keeper of the Key. Be brave now. She's just gonna open this up. Oh, I'll open my heart for you. Yeah, I was gonna say, we're gonna fall through. Oh. Can you please wake up again, Mabuka? Oh, I have so many questions. Alright. I was like so already bopping to the music and then I and then it registered. Oh my gosh. Oh, that creature's body is made out of baby faces. 
you know from... Do I know you from somewhere? You took something from me, didn't you, you little thief? Where's my knitting needle, eh? I will stab all of your little friends with it. Oh, did you stab? Oh, that's the lady who was in the chair. What? Knitting needle? Are you, are you the dead nurse I saw back in Oswald Asylum? Do I look dead to you, huh? You little beast. Take a number, would you? And wait your turn in the waiting room. But Miss Nurse, I don't need medical attention. I want to find my kitty. Take a number and wait. I won't repeat myself. It better not be like 666. Oh, we're seven. That's alright. The second number, I hope I get a good one. They listen, they see, and they touch. What? I'm a, in a way, I feel like I'm back in the Oswald Asylum. But it can't be, or can it? It's locked, but, if I do, but it doesn't have a keyhole. How do I get in then? Hey kid, this is my turn now to talk here. With the nurse. Oh, with the nurse, alright? If you don't wait and leave us alone, I'll tear you apart and eat you. Ew, you eat children? Did you know that we children are actually immature? Im immature? Hey, hey, leave the patient now alone now. The doctor will determine the severity of the illness, don't you worry. Ah, just take a number and wait your turn. So, oh, we can go this way. For some reason, I thought I was going to have to stab somebody. Oh, I wonder how long I must wait now. Hours? Maybe days? Aha! I've been waiting a week now. How long has everyone else been waiting? Hmm, I've been waiting for like a month. But I have number two, so it must be my turn very soon. I've been waiting for three and a half weeks. Totally hopeless. Um, <clears throat> excuse me everyone, but is there a way to make things faster? Yes, become a doctor yourself. That would be faster. And by doing that, you could also help us all. But why won't you become a doctor yourself then? I can't because I'm very sick. I can't. My R eye is blind. I have this broken horn, you see. I can't be a doctor. I must be a patient. Neither can I. I lost my ability to frighten myself in front of the mirror. Well, I'm not sick at all. Please let me go before you, okay? I can't. I don't even know what illness I have. That's why I'm here. Hmm, but how do you n not know? Do you feel it pain somewhere? That's a very hard question. Make it softer. How can I make a question softer? That's very strange. Hey, have you tried pulling your eyes off? It helps sometimes. Ah, oh, enough. It's impossible to talk sense with any of you. Of course you can't make sense of us. You're not the one that sees it all. You're only, you've only known us for a few minutes. That's very little time to understand at all. That's true, but it would be nice to use some common sense. Why? What does common sense do that uncommon sense doesn't? Well, it helps you to, be, to, to better understand each other. We do understand each other very well with our uncommon sense anyways. This conversation's giving me a headache. Yes, we actually do. We do respect the differences. Hmm, but who is the one that sees it all then? You mean Mabuka? No, Mabuka knows everything. It's not the same as seeing everything. Now, I want to wait, because talking may, won't make the wait go faster. Excuse me? I'm loving, I'm loving this in the background. Um, uh, alright, thank you for nothing. Oof, oof. Oh, waiting was fun at the beginning, now it's just boring. Wait. I think my horn won't grow up again. I'm going to be very angry because of that soon. Oh, very soon. Do you see that screen? I I have number two. It's almost my turn. My RI is broken. The big eye told me that because she sees it all. That must be the number display. Huh, I have number seven. It will take ages to get there. It must be get a better number like number two do you see the screen I have no oh my gosh 
Would it be possible to exchange our tickets? I have number seven. No, I need to know if I'm in pain. I know. I need to know what illness I illnesses I have. What if I found out what illnesses you have? Would you then give me your ticket? Sure, if I'm still here when you come back. Stabby, stabby. Sure, it's not your turn yet. How do I find out? How I'll give you my ticket only when you find out about my illnesses. The all-seeing one. Wait. Can we go back up? Oh, we can. Let's go talk to that eye guy. He said he could see everything. And he was talking about the all-seeing one. Excuse me, I need your help. Of course you do. What can I do for you? Can you tell me what illness the creature who has ticket number two suffers? He's in the waiting room and wa waiting room waiting. Hmm, let me see. Ah, I see him, but from what I see, it is not really an illness. It's just a headache because of the low levels of agony in him. Well, but is it possible to help him somehow? I need his ticket. Yes, crying all the tears you can cry until you fill this bottle. We'll do it. But don't forget the tears must be ca caused by real sorrow. That won't be a problem. I'm very pro- I- I'm in a very problematic point in my life. <laughs> that is such a mood. I thought everything was going to be better when my kitty and I got home. But now everything is so confusing. Aunt Grace is totally crazy. Talking to her was horrible. I really trusted her. But I know what to do now. Mabuka said I was selected for something. But if she fell asleep again and won't answer my questions. I need my kitty. Mr. Midnight's- Hugs are the best, biggest comfort in my life. I just want to find him so we can go back to this land and be happy. Oh, mm, lovely pain, so profound. The bottle is now full of your tears. Give it to the critter that has your ticket. Go now. Time does not wait for nobody. Thank you. I'll be going now. Goodbye. Either I read that wrong or that was a double negative. Way. That way. <sighs> that way. Use flask of tears with patient. That's gonna be really salty. Here, drink this. It'll make you feel much better. Oh, trying to poison me. Haha, <laughs> how lovely. Let's see. It tastes like the most profound and darkest elixir I've ever tasted before. He drank it anyways. Oh, you're trying to poison me? Drinks it anyways. Give me more. Give me more. No, leave me alone. You promised to give me the ticket if you helped. If I, if I helped you. All right, all right. Here you go. And thank and thank you for your tea. Thank and thank you. Your tears tasted absolutely delicious. The baby is bleeding. That's where the blood's coming from. Oh. Yay, number two. You stick it with nurse. Hello, patient number two. We're going to, we're going to do everything we can to save you. Do you have an appointment? Well, not really. You told me to take a number and wait. I'm sorry. We don't help sick people with a, an appointment. But I'm not sick. I lost my kitty, and I just want to find him. I lost kitty. Don't worry. That's a natural reaction to your sickness. You're lucky though. Many lose their minds and lose their mind instead. Ha! Lucky. But how do I get an appointment then? I'll just call me. Here's my card and the, t and the telephone number. But why must I call you? Why can't you just make an appointment now? Oh, that would be silly, because now I'm waiting for you to call me. Oh, alright, I'll go make the call then. Oh my gosh. The longest part of this let's, let's play will be going through all the freaking doors. I'm going to have to go past the skeleton guy again. Oh. 
Oh, hello, yes, you told me to make a call and make an appointment? Hmm, it's Fanboy. Uh, hmm, I'm available now. No, no, uh, no, yes, I have a pair of eyes. Really? Okay, I'll see you in a minute then. Great, great, thank you. Yeah, bye, yes, bye. Oh my gosh. Was that part of the game really necessary? <laughs> oh my gosh. Slowly losing my mind over here. Hello, patient number two. Do you have an appointment? Yes, Frambo is my name, and the appointment is now. Let me check the achieves. Yes, there you are. The doctor will see you in a minute. Just go through the door to your right. All right, then, thank you. Finally. I'm sorry, did I scare you? You look quite pale, pallid. Whew, yes, yes, what a nightmare. You look like a healthy human. <laughs> oh, thank you, I guess. Now, if you don't mind, I have an appointment. We scared the go- Okay, yep. Yeah. I don't mind, actually, because it's none of my business. What a polite ghost. Nice. You haven't chosen to end your life yet? Isn't the pain you feel enough? You're a rumor, aren't you? I haven't gotten the chance to introduce myself properly. Sadly, I cannot be seen in the third reality for long periods of time. I'm Rima, the terrible black prince of darkness. That's me. I know who you are. Don't try to act like nothing happened. There we go. There we go. Camera died, but we're back. Did you kill my parents? Where's my cat? What did you do to Dr. Dern? I enjoy immensely seeing you suffer seeing you suffering dripping off your eyes i feed from it you are the manifestation of my desires i can use you for whatever i want that's just weird you are under my power that's not true not anymore i will not allow you to trick me anymore tell me why did you kill my parents why you are amusing and uh, that is why that it was i who did such a terrible thing? Oh, you were. S it's not amusing. It's assuming that makes more sense. You were assuming that it was I who did such a terrible thing. I saw you that night outside my window. It must be you who did it. You trust your eyes too much. Haven't you learned that the human receptors are weak? Your body is fragile, easy to corrupt. Gonna show us what happened. <gasps> no, it can't be. Stop it. No, no, seriously. This way too predictable. It wasn't us, really. I didn't do it. I didn't. It wasn't me. Stop it, please. He's just tricking her. Who was it, my darling? Who killed your parents? The dull little critter must suffer and die before coming, becoming a star. Wasn't her, really? I don't trust anything in this game. I haven't killed my parents. I haven't. The monster wants to trick me, I know. Everybody is crazy around here. I have to find my kitty and leave. Wait. A tank with water. That's good. Why does the brain have two sides? The brain has many different parts. The spine. All humans have that in common. Hee <laughs> hee. It would look so funny without skin. Oh, I would look so funny without skin. Okay. Oh, my kitty! Uh, no concern. Straight for the cat. Fair, fair enough. Kitty, my darling, I'm here for you. Are you alright? Kitty, answer me. What is wrong with you? Meow, meow. Why won't you talk to me, Mr. Midnight? Please don't do this to me. 
Brrr. Talk to me, Mr. Midnight. This isn't funny. It's this place, isn't it? You must, I must get you out of here so you can talk to me again. I'll take you to the, this land, my darling. Platon, Platontris, Platontris will help us. I promise you nothing will tear us apart again. Meow. Oh, kitty. I'll be right back. I must help Dr. Dern, all right? He seems to be in trouble. Dr. Dern, are you all right, sir? Sir, wake up, please, Dr. Dern. Wake up. Are you alive, sir? Ah, oh, what should I do to wake him up? Not yet. A syringe with red full inside. What could it be? Do we use it on him? He maybe this will wake him up. Oops. I know you get an achievement for shocking him, so maybe I should have shocked him. Ah, damn. What was that? Don't worry, Dr. Dern, it was me, Fran. Uh, what? I can't see very well. Fran Bowser from the Oswald Asylum. We were at the cemetery, remember? Fran, what happened? Why am I tied to a chair? What have you done? Oh, I'm trying to help you, sir. The big monster brought you here. We must go. Come on, Fran. Monsters? I don't feel like playing games. Alright, it wasn't a monster at all. Just let me help you. But what is she doing here? I thought you chained her. Oh, uh, I did. I told you she was a hard one to tame. Did you... Do you want me to get rid of her? Get rid of me? Aunt Grace? Why are you talking like that? Who is this old man? How lovely. You sound like your mother when she was young. And was it her father? Is this the fa uh, the the mother's father? My mother? Do you know her? Who are you? I'm Dr. Oswald Harrison. Never mind. I know everything about you, Fran. Oswald? Can you not phone? Oswald from Oswald Asylum? Yes, Fran, the same old man. But why... Do you know about my mother and my aunt? Well, many years ago, I was studying the mis magnificent complexity of twin siblings. Lucia and Grace were part of my study. Both helped me to find the key to success. The key? Hmm. Did you know that my mother and father were murdered? Yes, of course. Rima did a great job. His power of manipulation is extraordinary. What I don't understand is how you can be so calm about it. It was you holding the knife after all. I'm not calm, sir. I knew it was Rima all the time. But why does he haunt me? So even if she if she did do it, by pen, if she did do it, it was because Rima made her do it. So either Rima did it and made her think she did it, or Rima made her do it and made her and she forgot. Rima is the manifestation of your weakness. A blinded and powerful manifestation of your weakness. But why would mo the monster kill my parents? Because your parents were infe interfering with my work. But I actually did you a favour. You were suffering. Wait, is Grace and the, her, her mother, were they the twins? No, that can't be right, because they died. No, and that's why it was Mia and that. So they must have just been part of the study. And pain is connected to growth and strength, Fran. Oswald, please, let's just do what we need to do. Aunt Grace, please don't be mad at me. We're family. Let us go. My kitty and I can find a place to go without bothering you. Please just let us go. Yes, you're right, Fran. I'm sorry for being so hard on you. Come on, let's go now. No, I'm not going with you. Can we still shock the doctor? I want the, the thing. I think I'll just leave it here. Yay! This is Electra Man. Got the achievement. Dr. Dune, are you alright, sir? Go with your aunt, friend. Isn't that what you want? No? She's scary. What's she gonna do? No! Friend, my dear, listen to me. Don't you dare! 
You must know Dr. Oswald only wants the best for you. When Lucia was pregnant with you, he knew you'd be a very special girl. He told us to take good care of you, but your mother betrayed us. She wanted to hide you from us. She thought you wanted to ki she thought we wanted to kill you, but that's not true. Dr. Os Oswald really wants to give you the best, but for that you must allow him to try a little experiment on you, and then everything will be fine. Of course, though there is still one thing we must take care of. This little traitor must go. Push, push, push her off? My no, don't tell me I came this far for nothing. No, no, kitty. Don't touch me. Go away. Come on, friend, stop weeping. The cat is dead now. But he was my friend. You killed my best friend. You also helped. You also helped kill my parents, didn't you? Didn't you? How can you live with yourself? I hate you. I hate you. No, Fran. Don't do it. Stop it, Fran. Help. Help. Please help. Don't. I don't. I don't want her to kill her aunt. Even if I said I wanted her to. This is the experiment. Don't you dare touch Grace, you little monster. No, it's not. Oh my goodness, she's totally insane. Bring her to me. I'll do the experiment while she's still warm. I need to extract the brain right away. Fran, are you alright? What have you done with her? She tried to kill me. You were right about Fran, Dr. Dern. She was sick. But she's bleeding. Let me take care of her. No, you won't. She's mine now. I've been waiting for this moment for many years now. Looking for the right child, the right brain. Now that I have heard, nothing can stop me. <laughs> it would! Oh, good. Oh, Fran, everything will be fine. Who, who are you? Uh, who, who, who are you? Yeah, there we go. I'm Edward, the one many children talk about. But, but you're not human. Ikro, bro, ikto, proto, platonus. Oh, platontrus. Wanna kiss? Ah, there we go. Got to us. Edward, I found him. Oh my goodness. Stay away from the girl. Leave her alone. Ah, oh, it's too tight. Little Fran must be cured. Do you think you can use the same body? Yes, she's not completely gone yet. Here I go. Oh, Mother Mabuka, you took the, inno you took the innocence of the child. Fran is now dead and alive. Wake up in darkness, Fran, and you'll be able to walk towards the light. It would just smack them out. Aww. Oh, this is cute. Sorry, this is adorable. What happened? It went platontrous. My heart hurts. Mr. Midnight, how? You're alive, my kitty! I missed you so much. Please tell me something. Fran, I must go now. Go? Alright. No, it would stay. You yeeted them out. I love you so much. I'm so glad he's fine from the crash. Dr. Dern, look, this is Edward and Platontress. I told you about them, remember? I told you they were real. See? Can you believe me now? He's like, uh, no. Oh, did the injection kill him? He can't hear you. I think he's under the power of Mabuka now. You really mu we really must leave now. But can he come with us, please? He's been really nice to me. He really wanted to protect me and help me. We can't bring him with us. I'm sorry. 
But what we can do is make him believe that all of this was a dream. He will wake up and think none of this really happened. But he won't remember you, Fran. I see. Well, that's okay, I guess, as long as he is safe. That's very kind. You finally see beyond your own desires. You are becoming one with everything. Your parents will be very proud of you. You really think so? Oh, thank you, Platontris. Oh. Now let's send Dr. Dern home. Marcel Dern omnium viacum sedulat irto. I thought you just like grew. Goodbye, Dr. Dern. Let's go over now, friend. There's so much you must see and learn. Hee <laughs> hee, that sounds like fun. Let's go, kitty. I still don't know many things. Welcome to the club. But one thing I do know. That between guilt and fear, I choose happiness. Oh, that's a good one. That's good. The whole squad's here! Oh. They're going back to this land, Ian. This land. Is Thurstra. Oh my gosh, that was so good. I'm so happy the ending was happy. I was so worried for a minute there that that was going to be such a bad ending and I was going to be upset and oh my gosh, because I've heard... Well, I didn't hear anything about the game, but... Recently, with the release of Little Misfortune and me watching, like, Let's Plays for that, I hear a lot about, obviously, Fran Bo, and I was worried that some of the things I was hearing implied that this was going to have a really sad ending. Though there might be an after credits yet, so I'll just wait. But I'm so glad this had a good ending. Even if it was sad, in the sense that, like, you know, I don't, I don't know. Like, the, the story itself, I mean, is sad, but... Oh, I loved it so much. It's a good... This is a good way to finish, like, Franbo, I reckon, after spending so much time doing this. Um, definitely a lot more Let's Plays than probably the standard needed, but... Yeah, this was, this was so much fun, and I'm so glad I played this. Um, thank you to Kayla for suggesting this to me. Um, and yeah, and we also got the... There's a few achievements I didn't get, but maybe I'll replay through and try and get those achievements. Yeah. I'm so glad it was okay, and then Mr. Midnight ended up being okay, and that Botontris came back, and then Dr. Dune was okay. Everyone that has been a part of the development of the of the journey as a backer, motion supporter, and a uh, YouTuber and review to you who believed in us. Aww, that's really sweet. Fan artists, YouTubers, I like how they've acknowledged everyone too. That's so cool. Overall review, totally not regretting playing that in the slightest. It was also a really good, well it wasn't the first horror game I played for this channel, but it was really a really good start, like a really good series, and I'm so glad I finished it. There's so many series on my channel at the moment that I've started and not completed. This is one I'm so glad I came back to. Oh, I hope there wasn't like an after credits, I just clicked out of it. No, no, no. The little red pills. Right, well that is everything. Thank you all so much for watching. Um, if you like the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Comment down below what you think, um, if I missed anything, or how I can get the things I missed. Um, just if you want to chat about Fran Bo and our playthrough, that would be awesome. Game recommendations, requests, challenges, you guys know the drill, just comment below. But thank you all so much for watching, and make sure to subscribe to my channel. Oh, more spooks to come. By the way, hopefully, may not be in the up until the 30th because I've still got my placement, but definitely more spooks to come. Okay, I'm done.